of the day. I'm wearing like this vintage like gray t-shirt underneath um, this sweatshirt my parents got me for Christmas. I was like, I want an oversized sweatshirt. Love the National Predators. So um, underneath where you like can't see it, I'm wearing uh, this necklace and it's matching bracelet. Will anybody get to see those today? Probably not, but I like to wear them. So there they are. Uh, and then I'm probably gonna wear, I'm barefoot right now, but I'll probably be wearing like my white Nike shoes or some white sneakers, something comfortable to walk around campus with. So my classes don't start until later in the morning, but I'm gonna go to campus a little early and try and pick up a textbook that I thought was gonna be able to get um, the online version, but it turns out that it's only available like hard copy whether you order it online or not. So I'm just gonna go to our student supply store and go pick up the textbook there and get the homework code because I think it's gonna be a little bit cheaper than ordering it straight from the source online. It's actually been over a year since I last stepped foot on campus for a class. And I'm, it's, like, it's like the first day of college all over again for me and I kinda hate it, but it's been good to be off campus and get that work experience. But it's super weird going back. Here's, I decided to go with the Nike shoes. Ta-da. Okay, let's go to class. Hey guys, it's a funny story. Um, last clip was from Wednesday morning. It's now not Wednesday afternoon, not even Thursday. It's now Friday in the afternoon. Um, I just totally completely forgot. So yeah, I'll try and be better about vlogging, but school was way, way, way crazier than I thought it would be um, these first couple days. So probably gonna change into some more comfortable clothes and then have a really, really late lunch. It's like three something. Probably use up my last avocado and like make an egg or something. Hey guys, so it's like an hour or so later and I am going out in a little bit, but I wanted to get a little bit of homework done. Um, I was just writing out um, the open system energy balance equation that my professor wants us to use. He wants us to do it a little bit different than um, if you're familiar with this, then you'll like probably, you probably won't recognize this, but essentially he wants us to include a term on the left-hand side for accumulation because like the basic equation you're normally given does not include the accumulation. It's just for like steady state systems. So you'll see like, um, you would normally see the, these out and in terms on the other side, like out minus n, um, for enthalpy, um, potential energy, and kinetic energy equals like the heat and the work. But the way that this is written, if you don't have a steady state process, um, then you have that accumulation term included. Um, and underneath are just a few pointers of like how to proceed with the equation, like easy ways to knock out terms. Um, like the first one, if there's no accumulation, which is all we've worked so far. And then um, we were given this little sheet about different devices and kind of what you can assume about the work term. And so, you know, like say it was a humidifier, they say to treat work um, as if it's zero. So, you know, you can eliminate this term. Um, you probably don't care about this, but if there are any engineers or chemists out there, um, this is what I'm doing in thermo right now. Again, we're like two days into class. Um, so... I think we have a quiz next week on this, so I'm just trying to make sure I understand all of it. So it is now many, many, many days after I started this vlog. I kind of epically failed at trying to film on campus this week. Um, like I said, I literally made a plan in my head. I was like, I'm going to take out my phone and vlog a little bit. And every single day I completely forgot. 
it's like the day just gets so totally crazy um it's like as soon as I get out of the class I go to Starbucks and study um or like meet up with some friends and we'll study together uh so it is just like back and forth all day and then I've got various clubs and other commitments afterwards so I will definitely try and get some more um like on campus footage and throughout the week footage but it's the weekend um I've just done a little bit of studying I've got some stuff due right when we come back um, like Monday and Tuesday um, but I wanted to quickly show like I went to Barnes & Noble with my friend yesterday and picked up a new Bible she's a very pretty blue color realized that I was using a kids Bible um, I mean like most of the time like I'm like not gonna lie I'm not very good at picking it up and reading it and so I don't think I ever really realized for all like this entire time I've been using a literal children's Bible so it's so, like it's time to go get a new one so yeah, I just wanted to share that, but I'm about to go do some more shopping. I need to pick up a new pair of leggings because I've moved so much in the last couple of years. I think I've lost a couple pairs, you know, like one ripped and then, you know, something got lost. So I'm down to just a couple pairs. And since like, that's all I wear around campus just for um, being comfortable, I need a new pair um, and possibly another sweatshirt because that's also all I wear while I'm on campus um, and pretty much on the weekends unless I'm going somewhere that I need to dress up for so might try and look for something not really looking for anything in particular so let's go I love how dirty my mirror is but I'm gonna take my, my baby out she's so beautiful um, I can show you the inside I love that like nothing in my outfit matches whatsoever but we're just gonna go with it and go shopping i forgot to mention that yesterday before i went to barnes and noble with my friend to pick up that bible i went and got my nails done i got gel on my fingers and the matching color and regular polish on my nails and the reason i decided to go and i got like one of the fancy pedicures um also that on my back um, window is from my dog when I've driven him around I'm just like too lazy to clean the inside of the car sorry um, anyways I went and treated myself because I'm currently taking um, a chemical engineering thermodynamics class um, and my university does it a little bit a little bit differently than from what I've heard at other places we just have like one thermo class um, both Mechies and Chemies and a lot of places will divide their thermodynamics into two semesters. Like the book we're using is meant for two, but it is a one semester class. We meet like every day and it's really intense. Um, and I got a hundred on our first quiz um, and I really feel like I'm doing well. So after this like really busy first hard week, I decided to treat myself to that yesterday. hey guys it's me currently editing this vlog i didn't remember to film an outro because i had intended once again to get more footage for the vlog but just didn't have time to with all the craziness going on um and so yeah i'm sorry i didn't get as much footage on campus and doing various activities throughout the week as I wanted to but I'm gonna be honest like like I said it's just not easy to remember to pull out your phone or camera and vlog while you've got important schoolwork to work on I wanted to film this as kind of an outro and to say that if you have any questions about chemical engineering or engineering or co-ops in general during college please comment them down below I'm gonna go through some of my old videos and look at questions I've received to film a chemical engineering student Q&A video. While I'm editing this video, I have exactly 999 subscribers, which is crazy because I started this channel several years ago just to have a creative outlet for myself because um, I'm an engineering major. I really like math and science and 
and that kind of stuff has always been interesting to me but I'm also a super creative person who enjoys art and making videos um, but I just can't believe that nearly a thousand people want to watch my videos um, so if it's still at 999 when this is uploaded subscribe help me get to a thousand um, and if it's at 1000 thank you like it's pretty crazy also I can get my ad revenue back and put that money back into my channel I have some things to say about why YouTube took that away in the first place but that's another conversation for another day um, so again thank you so much for watching this video I hope you enjoyed a little glimpse into what life is like for a chemical engineering student outside of just the day-to-day -day classes don't forget to like comment and subscribe and I'll see you next time bye